Thank you so much for helping me Benson. If you two weren't my best friends, I would be done with my life. No problem dear Phoebe. We are friends since our childhood. That's what friends are for. So, your name is Phoebe, right? Yes, why? Nothing. <laughs> Man, look at yourself. You thought I will do something with you together, right? No I didn't. Girl, this is a school full of cool students, and I think you should improve yourself. Alright? Now don't disturb me, I have to go to the headmaster. Why? What do you want from the headmaster? If it's about showing the school around, don't worry, I will show you the whole school. You are trying to flirt with me, so we too will be a couple? No. You have a girlfriend, it's not possible. So, if I don't have a girlfriend, you will be my girlfriend? Am I really your type? You are such an idiot. I won't do that to my new bestie. Now don't follow me, or your girlfriend will think we flirt each other. The biggest love begins with hate and fights. You won't be my boyfriend, because I don't have feelings to you. Look at that bitch, what does that bitch think who she is? I will show it to her. Phoebe, there you are? Yes, wait a second please. You better go, or Nicole will think you are flirting with me. Alright, see you in the classroom. Wow, you are so early here. Don't you like to sleep one hour more? I can do nothing about it if my bus and train is early. Or I have to wait two more hours unnecessary. Man, it must be really exhausting to get up really early just to be at the school in time. It is right. Do you want me to pick you up from home every morning? Do you really think I will go out with you just because you are rich? No, I just want to help you, that's all. And I don't want to accept your help. I want to do this by my own, because I don't like to get helped from those who I don't know. You will know me soon, even my underpants size. Stop talking bullshit, you are making me sick. I was just joking, that's all, come on, don't be mad now. So, do you really want me to pick you up from home? so you don't have to wake up so early? Wow, I think you are a proud girl. Please remember what I say now. Too much proudness won't help you in your life. Alright fine, I will go to the cafeteria. If you feel bored, just come to the cafeteria. Why are you still here? Don't you want to go home? I am hungry, don't you see it? I will sit in front of you now. I have to tell you something. You are beautiful, you know that? And I want to ask you something. Am I handsome? Kinda, yes. You look a bit cute. Do you think what I think now? You mean, you, and, you, and me? <laughs> are you fucking serious? Did you really think, we two will be a couple? You are so funny, really. You poor thing. Do you want to build up your self-confidence? What happened? Is your girlfriend, Nicole making you too much stress or what? Doesn't she allow you to give her peach to you, so you can have your fun or what? Of course you will look at me like that, because I am telling you the truth, right? You guys are always the same. You always want to have that one thing, after that, 
You guys feel like the kings, or boss, or the coolest bad boy or whatever. Ha ha, ha 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 ha. Could you just calm down now? I was just joking. You are such an idiot. If I were you, I would be more respectful or to a girl like me. I will piss off from here, and you can have my food now. Pervert. Man, she is a different girl, and she can diss good. I think I like her, she is cool. Isn't that Calvin? Phoebe? What are you doing here? I am waiting for a friend, and what are you doing here? I came here for eat a menu, do I am starving, do you want to eat something too? Alright fine, I don't want to wait for my best friend. Good, you may eat here. I asked you, if you want to eat too. The bill goes to me. Are you sure? Yes of course, why not? We are classmates. Fine, you may pay for me. Thanks for paying the food, it was tasty. No problem, dear Phoebe. I have to ask you something. Why are you sometimes respectfully, and then joking? I am like this, to make new friendships. I can't understand you sometimes, you know that? Phoebe, I have to tell you something, but please don't be sad. What happened, Benson? I can't find the money. What? It's enough now. Nicole, could you go now? There you are babe, why are you still talking with those ugly losers? I told them, that they won't get any peace in this school, that's all. Are you done now? Yes. Great, let's go. I don't want to see those Edward and Phoebe ugly poor losers anymore. What did you just call us? Who do you think who you are? Be respectful to us you dumb ass bitch. I won't forget it what you have done right now. You are a proud girl, aren't you? Yes, I think you are. Listen to me one more time. Too much proudness won't help you in your life. Take your girlfriend and piss off from here now. Ugly poor loser. Phoebe? Don't ever try to talk to me, you are such an false dickhead. Phoebe, but... Kelvin! You better stop talking, or I will know how I can make you stop talking. Retarded bitch. Who do you think who you are? Be respectful to us you dumb ass bitch, I won't forget it what you have done right now. You are a proud girl, aren't you? Yes, I think you are. Listen to me one more time. Too much proudness won't help you in your life. Take your girlfriend and piss off from here now. Ugly poor loser. I dumbass. I forgot my phone in the class. Phoebe? What are you doing here? I wanted to see Mr. Hernandez, that's all. You came here unnecessary, he went out of the school. Whatever. I can see him tomorrow. But what are you doing here, isn't it too early to pick up the topics for the presentation? Excuse me but, I won't waste my time now. I have to go to the classroom. Would you stop stalking me? What is your problem? I am not stalking you. I have to go to the class too, you remember. We are classmates, right? 
all right fine. But don't talk with me, until we arrived in our class. All right, fine. What is going on here? We stuck in the elevator right now. Please Kelvin, please call someone who can help us. I am so afraid to be in the stuck elevator here. I forgot my phone. I forgot my phone too. What should we do now? Well, we have to scream for help now. It looks like no one will arrive to save us. Don't you think, it looks kinda suspicious here? Fuck you bitch, I even didn't think about it. We two stuck in the elevator, and you think about that? What kind of man are you? Why are you angry right now? Who knows, when we two will fall in love each other. Wait, did the elevator start to working again? Yes, I think so. Finally, the elevator is working. After we two went out of the elevator, don't try to talk to me, you have a girlfriend, and I don't want to get in trouble. Alright, fine. Don't worry. Phoebe, you don't have to do that. I could give you the money now, so you can stop being a waitress. It is not your business Calvin. If I have to earn money, then I have to work. I cannot accept your money then, or better said, I don't want your money for no reason. Well proud girl, I just wanted to help you for your mother. You, and help? Don't make me laugh Calvin, your goal is to make our lives difficult by bullying us, what the fuck are you talking about for help? Because we are poor, and can't buy anything, what you rich kids have. I even can't buy my mother her medicines, or I can't pay our rent. I can't even buy a tea at school, because I'm afraid that the leftover money will be used up. I need the money for my mother's medicines. That's why I am here right now, so I can finally buy my mother's medicines. I will do anything to heal my mother, and you two won't hurt me by bullying me. Phoebe I. I didn't know that Nicole would do such badass plan. I thought we are just drinking here. Calvin stop talking. You humiliate yourself when you talk. I won't believe any words what you say, because you two are cruel and bad humans. Babe, why are you talking with that ugly poor bitch? Nicole. Be respectful to me, I swear I will beat you up. You can't do anything, or you won't get your money. Where are the drinks I wanted? I couldn't find them. Oh yeah, I know why. The drinks are to 100% there, but do you are a poor loser, you don't know how they look like. Now go again, and bring them. There you are, proud girl. Kelvin. Could you please go? I am studying for the math exam. I want to talk with you, proud girl. I heard your mother. <sighs> passed away. I am so very sorry about that, my condolences. Tell me something about her. She was the youngest mother I know. She will turn 34 this month. You ask yourself, why she was too young? If you allow me, I want to know. That one bastard who should be my dad. He left her, because he wasn't ready to have a baby. I am so sorry. He pissed off somewhere in England, so, I never saw him, and never heard his voice. Anyways. My mother told me every time before going to bed, that I should drink my warm milk with honey, do I have sleeping problems? If not, then I would look like a ugly monster, 
who couldn't sleep last night. My apologies. Anyways, my mother told me many sayings about the life, and almost all of them are so true. Her sayings helped me through anything. I see, she was a great young mother. She was actually very good at cooking, but you don't know how. She has won over 10 cooking challenges. Wow, that's really impressive. Thanks, now would you excuse me, I want to study for the math exam. Phoebe, I want to tell you something. I don't know how to say that, I am shaking a little bit. Just go ahead. What's the point of living if I have to hide it? Phoebe, you are a really different girl, and I love those types of girls. Phoebe, I want to. Yes. I love you, Phoebe. You are a different girl. You are so beautiful, pretty, cute, cool, and lovely. I want to heal your wounds. And I am serious right now. I guess? Who could it be? Kelvin, what are you doing here? Phoebe, why aren't you available? I tried to reach you. I need my piece now, would you please go? I have to study for the math exam on Monday, thanks. Phoebe, allow me to be by your side. Kelvin, I will be angry now. Would you go home now? And how could you find it out, where I live? I drove you one time to your home last week, remember? Okay, now please go. All right. Love you. Good morning, Phoebe. How are you doing? Could you let me eat something? I am starving now. I am starving too. Let us eat together. Are you prepared for the math exam? Do you think it will be a difficult exam? I think so. Phoebe, could you say something? I am talking to you. Phoebe, what is wrong? Since I kissed you, you are acting like you are empty inside. What happened? Kelvin, I want to eat something while I am studying. Would you mind your own business? No Phoebe, I want to know why you are trying to ignore me. Did I do something to you? Kelvin, I got kissed by you. I got kissed from my bully. Phoebe, if you want to, I can change for you. Don't you realize that I love you? I can't be in relationship with you, all right? You bullied me and Edward because we are poor. Now shut the fuck up and go. Is that so Phoebe? I should shut the fuck up and go. Yes, exactly. I currently don't want to see any one of you because I want to study just to forget the pain for my mother's loss. Phoebe, don't ever try to hurt me. Stand up now. What? I said stand up. Look my friend, if you don't stop disturbing me, you will never see my face and existence anymore. Now piss off from here. Alright fine, do you are mean to me, then I will be mean to you too. Piss off to your fucking girlfriend, and leave me alone. How did your exam went? Fine. I mean, I don't care about your exam, do you are mean to me? Then why did you ask me about my exam? Can't I forget it? What happened in the cafeteria? I forgot it at the moment. Good. Please don't forget it, because I don't want to see you. Oh, really? Then I won't talk to you anymore, 
Is that fine? Yes, do it like that, because I don't care about you anymore. I will go away from you now. Go now Miss Foster, if I don't make you jealous, then I am not Calvin William. How is that possible? My clothes aren't in this locker too. That Nicole bitch did that? I know that. If I don't go and kill that bitch, then I am not Phoebe. Phoebe, what are you still doing here? Kelvin, luckily you came. My clothes are gone. Nicole did that I know that. Wait here, I will find them, don't worry. Are you okay? Yes. Thank you Calvin for finding my clothes. No problem Phoebe. If I see Nicole somewhere, I will beat her up. Why did she do that? Don't worry, I will talk with her about that. <sighs> Phoebe. You know that I love you, right? Calvin, I can't be in relationship with you, because you were my bully. And you two bullied us, I cannot forget these times. I know. But give me a second chance, I will change for you. You love me too, I saw you yesterday, how you were sad. Calvin? Yes? You are right. I love you too, but I can't be in relationship with you. Yes, Calvin? Where you had been? I'm sorry that I left you behind, but my parents called me, so I had to go home. No problem. Phoebe, why did the police take you to the police station? I hope it's not something seriously. I had to pay the rest of my rent, 15 euros, that's all. What the hell, they are weird though. And I thought it's something seriously. I was afraid, if they will throw you into prison or something. Thanks Calvin for thinking about me. Of course, I will think about you. Phoebe, I have to hang up, because I will meet with Benson then. Oh yeah, I forgot in the moment, that you two are best friends too. Well, and I will go home, I have to study for the school. See you. Alright, see you, babe. What did you just say? Nothing. Bye. Phoebe, before I say something, you go first. Are you still mad at me? No Calvin, you can't do anything about it that Nicole declines you from now on. So I don't guilt you. Thank you Phoebe. Phoebe, do you actually trust me? Unfortunately no, currently not. I see. If I tell you, that I will change myself into a good human, will you trust me then? Maybe. And you will love me more, right? You know, you once confessed your love to me. I think yes. Awesome, from now on, Calvin William will turn slowly into a good person. Get ready, I will blow your mind with many surprises. Good morning Phoebe. Good morning. Do you want to walk with me to the Plotacity Park after school? Attention please, due to today's International Teachers Day, all students in this school may go home now. Have a great day. No Benson, I will walk instead of waiting for the bus. Are you sure about that? You have to walk 40 minutes to get home. I know, but I can't wait anymore. Alright. See you tomorrow in the school. The weather is so fresh right now. It's good that we came here. Yes it is. And thank you for accepting my wish. 
It's awesome that the school had to end earlier, but I still don't understand why. There will be a celebration of all teachers in the school, that's why. What is Phoebe and Calvin doing here? What does she have to do with him? I understand now. Phoebe. Yes, 